High school students hoping to make the world a better place were awarded grant money to help fund their efforts. News Watch 16's Courtney Harrison explains those projects and how organizers hope this inspires other students to get involved. Members of the Scranton Area Community Foundation and the United Nations Association of NEPA presented groups of area high school students a check for $1,000. The money comes from the Global Development Project Fund, which supports projects in local schools and community-based organizations that promote global awareness, citizenship, and development. Out of all of the applicants, four groups were chosen. What we wanted to do was give them the resources to undertake projects in their schools and communities that would have an impact on their greater world. It's very good to help the environment, not only do we stay in it, but to provide for living animals and help with their needs and to survive, just like us. Riverside High School students will be helping clean up trash along the Lackawanna River Heritage Trail in their community. The students will repurpose plastic waste and debris from the Lackawanna River into artwork. Make things like this for like hexagons and we're also going to recycle paper and we're going to put like art and stuff on that as well as trash that we use from the Lackawanna River. The Abington Heights Period Club was formed five years ago to provide menstruation education and products to people in need locally and in poor countries throughout the world. Our previous efforts have been based on donations mostly, um, although we sometimes use uh, fundraised money to purchase products. So this is a whole other amount of money that we can use to buy a lot more products and uh, hold a lot more community outreach programs. The two other grant recipients were Dunmore High School's Story Maker Project and nonprofit organization The Hexagon Project. The next round of applications for the Global Development Project Fund will open up next spring. Courtney Harrison, Newswatch 16, Lackawanna County.